Hello everyone, I'm Ray. Thank you for visiting my channel and please don't forget to subscribe. Today I'm going to show you how we built this launcher for a 30 foot wingspan drone. We started by getting an off the shelf trailer that we had to modify slightly in preparation to receive our framing members. Uh, the framing members were actually quite complicated. Uh, they involved quite a bit of water jet cutting, some precision measuring for the beams to be slotted through them along with other uh, cross members and, and gussets to be all properly aligned uh, in, in the end result in order to support the launch rails. There was quite a bit of fabrication and most of the parts were being cut simultaneously while the fabrication and assembly and welding was happening. So it was a very quick moving project. Uh, here you can see the alignment of the rails and the fitting of the castellated beams. The castellated beams support the launch rails and uh, launch tray that help to send the drone on its way. It's powered by a 5 inch diameter 40 foot long air cylinder and then we had to take the whole assembly and paint it uh, add the compressors, the storage tank, uh, generators, wiring, valving, etc, etc, all the necessary items. While the launcher was being built, simultaneously we were manufacturing the launcher tray. And it, it took thousands and thousands of rivets, as you'll see here, to assemble this launcher tray. The launcher tray supports the aircraft while it's sitting on the launcher uh, in order to be launched. Let's check out a few test fires. Nice. Very nice. Okay, go. Thank you all for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe.